Australians will soon be able to get their hands on Apple's new $6,000 mixed reality device. The Vision Pro goes on sale here on Friday and it's touted as a revolution in entertainment and productivity. Our science and tech correspondent Breno Halloran separates the facts from the hype. Australians love Apple devices. Their phones sell like hotcakes here. But it's expected the company's most advanced device yet may get a lukewarm reception. <laughs> Apple claims the Vision Pro ushers in a new era of spatial computing. Spatial computing is a big idea that you can see, hear and interact with your digital content right in your physical space. Movie screens stretch to any size, photos and videos made 3D, and workflows streamlined with multiple movable screens controlled with your eyes and finger gestures. The hand tracking, the eye tracking and the voice control combined for something you really don't get anywhere else. The Vision Pro launched in the US in February. It's available in Australia on Friday. The head-mounted 600-gram device has 13 cameras, a mini OLED screen with 23 million pixels and a $6,000 price tag. Yes, it's expensive now, but eventually these prices will go down. However, if you've got the money, I don't think you'll be disappointed. Aussie app makers are embracing spatial computing. Melbourne-based JigSpace has seen success with its Vision Pro app, allowing users to pick apart devices from printers to F1 cars. It shows the potential of the tech for designers, but perhaps not yet for the average Aussie. We're not seeing what we would refer to as the, the killer app, you know, the, the app or the, um, you know, the tools running on Vision Pro um, that are going to, you know, be a big, big change for people and are going to encourage large numbers to step up. There are reports production of the Vision Pro in the US has slowed due to a lack of demand. The cost, novelty and the success of competitors, including MetaQuest 2 and 3, leads analysts to temper expectations. At this stage, the Vision Pro is probably going to attract those biggest Apple fans and, and those that you know, really believe that they're going, to, uh, they're going to carry something spectacular off with the Vision Pro. Apple gave Sky News 45 minutes to try out the Vision Pro. It is indeed a remarkable bit of tech, offering incredible immersion. The lines outside this store on Friday morning will give us some indication of how interested the Australian public is in the so-called spatial computing revolution. Brent O'Halloran, Sky News.